Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 16 of the Adobe Premiere Pro training series. So today we're going to look at something called track mat. So how do we use track mat? All right, for that, I actually, um, uh, so what is track mat? Track mat is about taking the alpha channel of one layer and putting it on another. For example, if I want this video to be played on, um, let's say, let me just mute the sound over here because that is disturbing. If I want to play the uh, video uh, on a text-like feature or in a particular shape, then I can use something called a track mat. So let's use track mat and let's see how it works. And for that, I'm going to create a new item as a title. All right. So let me just create a title and name it track mat. All right. So there's the title that I have over here. So here I'm going to make some designs. I'm going to see this is a scenery of a temple area. That's um, so and let me just say temple. And let me choose something like a bold font over here and inside the title I'm going to see something like a thick font because I want the video to be played inside the uh, text right here. Let me just use a black yes. Okay, let me just increase the size of the text just like this. Alright, then I'm going to drag something like a shape. So this is also possible with the shape and then drag one up over here as well. So what I want to do is I want to be the video to be played inside the selected text only. So I'm going to select all of this and place it right over there. So let me just close that down and I'm going to uh, drag the track mat on the top layer right here. So let me just drag this out and you can see that my text is actually on top of the video. So now what I want to do is I want to apply the alpha channel of this layer, the video two layer onto the alpha channel, onto the video of uh, the hyperlapse a movie. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into effects and I'm going to uh, do something like a track mat. Uh, so let me just say track. Okay, let me just type track right there. And inside key, you can see something called track mat key. So I'm going to drag it and put it over hyperlapse movie. And inside, you see that there's a track mat key applied to it. And in the track mat key, you can see there's compose using mat author or mat luma. So inside mat, I'm just going to select video two because the alpha channel that I want to use inside is in video two itself. So I'm just going to say select video two. And now you can, you can see that my video is actually inside the alpha channel of this layer right here. And this is how the video actually seems like. So you see that this is very popular inside of movies and so forth. So now I'm going to do multiple sequencing. So now I'm going to create a new sequence. So let's say uh, I'm going to create a new item, like a sequence right there. I press OK. And then I'm going to drag the hyperlapse video onto it. Change sequence settings to match. And now what I can do is I can use this layer to create something else. So let's just create a new item like a color mat. Uh, let me just use a color mat. Let me use red a, as a color. Or you can even keep a picture over there. So let me just keep the color mat. You can see that now I have a video uh, on a particular background color that I want. So I can even choose yellow. So if you were to see Ferris uh, Williams' happy video, you can see this kind of an effect actually being played out. So this is how it is made. So hope you guys learn how to use uh, track mat key. So um, also hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.